It's very important to have the Child Parent Centre here in South Headland because there are uh, specific needs in the community. Um, parenting support is required and we really try and help. You know, engagement and communication are the two key things that we want in the school and I think uh, having the Child Parent Centre here, that will promote that. The communication and the partnerships will build as well and as that transition process goes towards school, uh, it'll be a smooth process and there'll be already partners with the school and obviously with engagement means better learning and with better learning it just flows on to careers in South Headland and beyond really so it's, it's really exciting for us. Of course we look after their primary needs first because if they're not healthy and they're not feeling well they're not going to be learning so if we get those things sorted early and that's exactly what the Child Parent Centre can support with we are starting with an advantage. Um, there's a real partnership in this community there's still a lot of hard work to do but um, the community is very passionate about this school, about this location, the Gadiata people. Uh, they're very proud and I'm proud to be part of it and it's um, a bright future ahead so it's good to see this and I'd love to see this in a couple of years, uh, the success that flows on. The YMCA has got the mandate to run the CPC um, to give um, families and, and children a chance to come together uh, for the parents to play with their children, but also having uh, learning outcomes like story time, um, reading books, so that um, children are in a sort of um, uh, familiar with the school environment. So that when they come to school, it's not as if it's a surprise. They know the place. Um, we believe that um, the family, the mother, is the best teacher to the children. So when the mothers work together with other women, um, sharing ideas, um, developing relationships, and it's a time for the mothers as well to have a time out uh, with their children and get to know other uh, mothers as well. But it also benefits the school itself. It's, it's, um, the school will be enrolling children who have the best, basic uh, literacy. The YMCA is benefiting the school by actually helping the school and transitioning children with the basic understanding of a school environment. Um, at the CPC playgroups we offer daily playgroups. Uh, we offer three through the CPC, we supply the service and then childcare links offer two more playgroups. So that's Monday to Friday 8.30 to 11.30. And then from the 21st of July we'll be offering the Gummala 3A programme. And that's really exciting. It's five days a week. It's uh, parents come at 12 o'clock, they have a light lunch. And then that program is about sort of connecting parents to their child's learning. I think the benefits of the playgroups that we're offering are that parents can connect with other parents. They can build up friendships. Um, it's a supported playgroup, so we model sort of how children learn. All our supported playgroups are curriculum based, they're embedded in the early years framework. So although it is a lot of fun, a lot of socialising, it is actually about preparing children for school. So our focus is school readiness. Well I love being located at a school because it links in well with the transition to school. So if we're focusing on helping children become school ready, then it just makes sense because they're on the school site. So parents from naught to four are bringing their children every day to a playgroup. So the transition to school is almost natural. So I, I think it's really brilliant being on a school site. Hey, I think it was an amazing opportunity today to do something extraordinary where in years to come, future Australian generations will look back on this time and they'll view it as a turning point in a way services are delivered uh, for children and families. If we didn't come here, we would have had no idea that Isla couldn't hear properly and, um, without the ear bus. And they've helped her hear and now her speech is coming along well. And I was asked about speech therapy, but the ear bus picked up her ears and now her speech is coming along well, which we've been offered assistance for her speech as well. It's helping a lot of people even just to come and have a bit of chill out time and while the kids play, have other people to talk to. Very supportive, there's lots of services that are provided and um, anything you need, it's pretty much at our fingertips.